Well, this is a really cool place. Like, say you're an art teacher or a drama mm -hmm. teacher, they have everything you need. Right. Corey's there at the Art Resource Center. Take us around, Corey. It is great. You are going to love this tour. And then here's, here's an example of the kind of creativity uh, that you're able to explore in a place like this. And an organization like this is so... It's just wonderful. It's it's uh, it's a clearinghouse for art supplies for nonprofit groups, and you talk about an angel, an art angel. It's Sherry Zeitlin, and thanks so much for sharing your mission with everybody. You probably only describe three or four times a week as an art angel. Well, I, it depends on who's talking. <laughs> well, tell, tell us what your mission is, and then we want to go see some of your stuff. Our mission is very simple. We collect and give away art supplies free. To any nonprofit, that's any 501c3 nonprofit that walks through the doors. Well, let's take a let's take a trip here, and uh, I think people are going to be stupefied by the, the array of options that you have here and the supplies. Well, let's start with the fabric. Uh, oh, and Tom's giving us a good look at your uh, Twitter handle and so forth, and your Instagram Thanks handle. But uh, here we are, this amazing collection of fabric. Uh, and who who's the typical artist, or what sort of organization needs this kind uh, of material? Theater groups come in to mm -hmm. do costuming. Dance troops come in. Many many teachers come in to customize their classrooms. Mm -hmm. There is an enormous amount of quilting that's come about again. Oh yes. And we just received fifty-four boxes of quilting material yesterday that we're trying to find a place to put on our shelves. <laughs> well, today. let's head over this way. Uh, paper supplies are huge. You must have boxes and stacks we, and reams. We do. This entire side of our facility is paper related in some way. That's everything from poster board to construction paper. To bookmaking supplies, to uh -huh. handmade paper, to educational materials, um, maps, posters, uh, photographs. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, that can be used. Can uh, be used for collage. Love that. And, right. and as we get into this last room, and then we'll, we'll have another opportunity to, to get together in a couple of minutes, <laughs> you talk, your sculpture, your sculptors, and uh, real mixed media artists have mixed a great chance in artists, here. Mixed media artists, robotics are huge, especially in our school systems now. And this is filled with metal bits and pieces that can be used in robotics, as well as plastics. If you think about the fact that that was ever made is still with us. Oh, um, which it's is, like water, but worse. It, it's much worse. <laughs> uh, it makes me crazy. So 15 years ago, I decided to open the Art Resource Center. Well, we can drink she water. To facilitate for the arts in uh -huh. every area. And people come from all over the state of Arizona. Well, to uh get materials. Well, you are a sweetheart to do it. And anyway, uh, you're on uh, Stains, quickly your address. Paints. You're on South uh, 910 South Hohokam in uh, Hohokam in Tempe. Anyway, uh, we got to fly for the moment, but more coming and your way. Uh, there's so much more to show you too. And uh, we'll cups. be back here at the Art Resource Center in a couple of minutes. All right, buddy. It's we'll like see you then. It's a treasure trove for artists. Love it. We'll yeah. be right back. Art Resource Center. Uh, if you're teaching art or robotics or all sorts of things. They have everything you need. It's a really free. cool place. Hey, Cor. It is such a clever idea. Yeah, it's a, it's a clearinghouse. I mean, it is a warehouse full of everything that every art teacher loves and, and the really kind of unusual stuff as well. Uh, if you need, I mean, if we got vacation stickers. I mean, who... who, who who has these? I mean, stuff, if you're going to travel around, you need something to put on your valise. We've got craft foam and get well stuff and acres and acres of fabric and posters and paintings that are already done and, and then all the supplies to make your own paintings. Um, I love, I mean, when I grew up uh, at Moore Street Elementary School in Millersburg, this was our, we had an art room and it was like this. It just had shelves and shelves of construction paper and brand new pencils and glue and, you know, all that stuff. Well, now a lot of teachers are, uh, and artists have to do that on their own. They're paying their own dime uh, for these kinds of materials. But here's a place that'll make it happen uh, for absolutely free if you're a nonprofit. And Sherry, um, let, let's, we don't have much time. Love you about a minute and a half, but let's look at this array. This gives you a nice, and sort of an overview of what you offer. Kind of go down the row here, Indeed. just point stuff uh, out. We have traditional art supplies, mm -hmm. including easels. We have broken jewelry that can be used in sculpture. 
We have probably 300 square feet alone of fabric, mm -hmm. crayons, balloons that can be used in a myriad of ways, and, and uh, shells. Such Who, clever things. Indeed. I, I suppose any artist, I mean, you're an artist yourself, a creative person, just walking through here is going to, your light bulbs are going to be it flashing sparks. all over, right? It does spark. Uh, slides. Someone came in yesterday. They're going to do a whole window with their students. They're going to tie them together, the old slides that we all remember. Oh, it looks like somebody reached under Celeste's bureau and oh, collected yeah. a lot of her earrings. Right. Indeed, we have She's a big lot of hoops. jewelry. <laughs> uh, we have books that people can fold into sculpture, lots and lots of paint. This is great. Now, again, you must be a 501c3 Correct. nonprofit organization, to but they can anything, just walk in the door? They can walk in the door and take anything away that free. Oh it doesn't gosh. cost anything. It doesn't seem like it makes sense. About but, four, but about four years ago, we started to allow artists and others mm -hmm. who are interested in the arts to come in and give us a donation and take things away. This is great. Hey, who makes it all happen? Let's bring the staff in over here, all of your friends who uh, really make this place hum. And My thank you. Volunteers. Yes, thank you all for your hard work. And uh, I'm telling you, you're going to be overwhelmed today. We want the door to swing and the phone to ring. Well, just make the door swing. And give us quickly your Instagram handle. Uh, Art Resource Center. It's there right here. Go. Easy to find. All, all right. right uh, give them a wave, everybody. So cool. Yeah, you're the sweetest. The Art Resource Center with underscores yeah. in between. What Excellent. A great place. Yeah. Nice work that they're Sweetheart. doing out there. Yeah. Right. Absolutely.